so I get this referral to build the set. And the, the title of the show is called Postcards. It's about history, culture, and music of the area, of the region, the western part of the state. The title, Postcards. The first thing that comes to mind is here somebody wants to illustrate you know, the uniqueness of a place, you know, somewhere that they have been that they want to share with someone else. One feature of the set is uh, a mail rail. So it's in the foreground and that can be used as a transition point. Go into the mailbox, open the mailbox, there's your postcard. Where did we go today? When I start a project, I usually I'm looking for some icons, you know, something that I can use for the backdrop. So being that this town, its major industries are grain and, and the railroad, I took a few photographs in the area to give me some ideas for the backdrop. The station is located in Appleton, Minnesota, in an old um, turn of the century opera house. Because of the confines of the studio, uh, we built it modularly. I create a real flat dimensional layout of it, a plan view, just what it's going to set up and what the requirements of the space is. And then from there, I kind of create everything three-dimensionally uh, in a program that you can actually move through and experience and I can get different points of view so you can, you know, I can actually drop the talent into the set and okay, this is where one camera is gonna be, this is where another camera might be. It's called SketchUp. It's actually a Google uh, design program. So there's a lot of images and different materials that you can go to the Google warehouse. We've been in business for 10 years, catering to uh, advertising, doing sets and props for television commercials, music videos. I built sets before, but uh, this project seemed to be a little more connected to the community out there. The backdrop for the set is a home, the front porch. This is a place where neighbors can congregate and talk about their daily affairs. But in a broader scope, in the background, behind the, this porch, there's the industry that supports the town. And there's the landscape, which is Minnesota. Pine trees, prairies. Things are on wheels to be able to move out of the way. Everything's portable and basically stores flat. It's kind of a space-saving design. The set takes about two weeks to build. I have these memories of my grandmother, you know, telling me stories about where she grew up. So she's talking about a place that, you know, it sounds like a land that's far, far away. Somebody in my family decided we gotta have a family reunion, you know. And this was a side of my family that I knew nothing about. Well, here, you know, three generations ago, we had this huge dairy farm in Malacca, Minnesota. I had no idea. I think a lot of people in these towns have these stories, you know, and you feel, you feel through the changes and, and the loss in, in commerce and the loss in some of these small family farms, there's still these stories behind that that need to be told. I feel fortunate that I'm able to do something that feels like um, something I'm genuinely interested in and I have a connection to like these areas. Sense of preservation, you know, it, it's capturing that time and a curiosity about what this place was, what these buildings, you know, what their function was back, you know, in the boom times. Friday rolls around, everybody goes north, but what, what's out in the western part of the state, you know? This program could help to create a roadmap to tell people, you know, what there is out there, or what's off the beaten path, what's on some of the county roads, what's, you know, down the dirt roads. It's, it's a worthwhile trip. Mm -hmm.